Yeah, it's a big deal for scientists, and it's a big deal for China, which is planning a manned mission to the moon in the coming years. And you're right. Some people call it the dark side of the moon. That's a Pink Floyd album. That's not science. This is the side of the moon that we on Earth don't see, and humans have never landed there before. For the first time, a landing on the far side of the moon. This extraordinary picture is sent from a Chinese rover opening up a new chapter in moon exploration. The probe, called Chang'e 4 after the Chinese moon goddess, blasted off a month ago, carrying instruments to analyze the unexplored region. Scientists hope this will provide more information about how our planetary system was formed. The crater where the Chinese landed is the oldest and deepest on the moon. So the discovery may offer insights into how the moon came to be. Some scientists suspect the area around the crater may be rich in minerals. Chang'e 4 is also carrying potato and plant seeds, as well as silkworm eggs for biological experiments. The landing underscoring China's ambition to join the space race in a major way, seen as a big milestone in space exploration and of great propaganda value back home. Only China, Russia and the U.S. have managed soft landings on the moon. The Chang'e 4 rover is the first to touch down on the side that always faces away from Earth. And while China is flexing its space Muscles, the U.S. has also set a space record. NASA this morning releasing the first photo of the most distant object humans have ever explored, Ultima Thule, which means beyond the known world. A mysterious body on the frozen fringes of our solar system, four billion miles away. NASA's New Horizon probe did a flyby on New Year's Day, a milestone cheered by the NASA team back on Earth. Tom, you're talking about the space race. I mean, how significant is this for China? Well, it means they've arrived. Uh, the Chinese launched more rockets than any other country last year. They have another lunar probe mission set for later this year. They're building their third space station. They're planning to put humans on the moon within 10 years or so. They'd like to put a colony on the moon, and they're dedicating big money to science and space exploration. But they largely operate in secret, not nearly as open and transparent as NASA. Hmm.